Welcome back everyone. This is Blue Dolphin with the Hoplite Security Channel and I'm just going to be doing a next day coverage for the Tenable CTF. Just going over a couple of things that occurred in the last 24 hours. Let's get into it. All right, jumping right into things here. I'm just going to be using the Discord announcement section. So yesterday, big thing happened. A second wave of challenges went live. Additionally, all unsolved challenges from the first wave have had their value increased by 100 points. That's amazing. Okay, there was some confusion around the characters of Shakespeare's play challenge. This has since been corrected and they've added some clarification. So thank you so much to the admin staff for jumping on that. All right, the notes challenge was temporarily taken down to fix a bug, but it was all fixed and it was back up. And big round of applause to SR02 for the heads up. Next is going to be the Casper the Friendly Sysop service. This was migrated to a new address, but the old one was still running till the end of the day. Now it's just to provide a better user experience. So thanks again to the administrator, Luca Lusa, if that's how you say her name. Really appreciate um, making that change there. All right. The next challenge that had been changed was the eavesdropper. Something fishy was going on with the eavesdropper service, which was resulting in players being disconnected every few seconds. Lusa or Luca here jumped in and got another instance of it running right away, which was awesome. It was up running quickly, smoothly. It was a fantastic user experience. Thank you so much for promptly jumping on that. Again, can't say enough about the Tenable admin team. They were amazing. All right, a hint has been added to the back then challenge because a lot of people were struggling with that and asking for help in the channel. All right, we then got an update from Luca or Lusa that she was hearing that some people are having trouble downloading the monstrously large your call is important to us mp3 file so she just offered a different link to download it so make sure you check that out it's being hosted on wormhole so i think that's just going to download quicker and it's going to allow for bigger load balancing all right there's also some clarifying comments that have been added to the description for the characters of shakespeare's play which we had mentioned earlier and then the mods went to bed. All right, so we woke up this morning and we learned that Luca or Lucha, so sorry if I'm pronouncing your name wrong, has actually added two hints for tech support, costing 10 and 50 points. So that's pretty cool, it's pretty interesting. Then Dino Bytes came with an update about a modification be made to the back then challenge. If you had previously put effort into this challenge and stumbled across things you thought were relevant, please revisit them just in case. All right, let's take a look at the scoreboard. Look at that beautiful Tenable shirt. Just an amazing shirt. Okay, so we're looking at the scoreboard here and you can see that we had some changes overnight here. So boot plug is running in first place, view source at second, and then we have the next, about five teams are neck and neck here from seventh to third, all kind of in that 4,000 range there. And as we scroll down, we really see that the that, that that point gap, there's no big gaps other than the first and the second team. It's a very smooth transition. And again, this is a sign of a very healthy CTF. And we really have to thank the Tenable team and the admins for creating this environment. Because quite often you'll see these massive skill gaps. And that's a sign that the CTF doesn't have the cleanest skill curve, which is fine. But I really want to point out the, the, the whole, the, all the team here did an amazing job. But otherwise, that's a wrap. See everyone in my write-up videos at the end.